Hello again. Welcome to the latest episode here on Generation X Tech. And what we're looking at today is eco bricks. What is an eco brick? I hear you ask. Well, these are eco bricks. They are simple fizzy pop bottles, as we call them here in the UK. You might call them soda bottles or soft drink bottles or something like that. Crammed full of non-recyclable plastic. They weigh about 650 grams or 23 ounces, around about that. And what I'm going to do with these is I'm going to use them to build a wall in the garden. In developing countries, these are actually used as part of walls for houses. It's a way that you can eliminate that plastic waste. It's very much on the political agenda at the moment with the environment, uh, with all this plastic that's cluttering up our landfill sites and our rivers and our oceans. You can do your bit to contain it. It doesn't resolve the problem of the amount of plastic that we're using, but it does stop it from entering the environment and uh, destroying things. So I'm going to tell you in this part of the vlog how to make an eco brick. So here we are, we have an empty pop bottle here. This is how we start. It's been washed out and it's ready to use. So we can start by peeling off the label, this non-recyclable plastic label. There we go, that's, that's it off. Then we can simply stuff it through the lid. You might want a wooden pole or a wooden spoon or something to stuff it in. There we are. That is just the start. Now what you've got to do is you've just got to take as much non-recyclable plastic as you can. You've got to wash it, you've got to dry it, make sure it's clean because we don't want any food residue being in here because that will cause methane gas which could ultimately blow the top off the bottle when it's done. This one, it looks full, but let's weigh it, shall we? Three hundred and forty six grams. So this is actually nowhere near full. We need to cram another three hundred grams into this. That's roughly uh, ten and a half ounces, I think, uh, before it can be called full. It needs to be rigid all the way to the top, literally until you can't get any more plastic into it. Otherwise, it simply won't be strong enough to support the weight that we're expecting this brick to support. So I have here a load of crisp packets or potato chip packets, as you might call them. And I need to wash them out, make sure there's no food contamination, cut them up small, and then we can stuff them in the eco brick. So there's a load of plastic here, we need to dry it out and then we can cut it up small The smaller you cut it, the easier it will go into the mouth of the bottle. Keep packing it down.
So you just keep ramming in that plastic until you literally can't get any more in. Like that. This one is completely full. Just make sure that you don't have it pressing against the cap because you could end up the top coming off and that will compromise the structure of the eco brick. But other than that, that's all there is to it. If you like my videos, then please feel free to subscribe. Just hit the button in the bottom right of this video and I'll be back very soon with some more great content here on Generation X Tech.